welcome to weekly vlog number two. This is not gonna be a very thrilling start to the week. Feeling very, very anxious, which isn't great. I think it's cause I had a really bad sleep last night. Like I went to bed at about 11 and I woke up every half hour till five. Um, and when I'm overtired, my anxiety is generally worse, but it's okay. I'm not feeling worried about anything. It's just like the physical side of things. So like I've got a lot of adrenaline and I'm feeling very overheated and I feel quite sick. Um, so it's not too bad, but it's not super fun. I'm probably going to open the window in a second and get some ice water because I feel like I'm going through menopause right now. Side note, I realize there's an entire season of Grand Designs that I haven't seen and I don't understand how that happened, but I'm about to watch it so it's okay. I think this bag is frozen food. By the way, it's several hours later now and I'm feeling a lot better, so hooray for that. Pizza pocket, hash browns, so, so far, so good for the clean eating. Avocados. Tomatoes, strawberries, bacon. Why is the bacon in with all the fruit? I really don't know. Margarine. I'm pissed, this should be bigger. We have some mozzarella. I'm very excited about this because you know how I love my cheeses. Croissant, shredded coconut, multi-purpose surface cleaning spray, refill for my air freshener. It is in the scent Crackling Fire and Cinnamon Spice. You'll need to check this out. It is by Airwick. There is literally no jest about this. This is fantastic. Fuck yes. Roll ups. Sweet corn. Baked beans. Ow. Very excited about the vanilla pudding. Organic green tea wellness and organic green tea detox. Because I'm almost out of these. Bananas so that I can put these in milkshakes. Sour cream and chives flavored soccer tarts. Now that I'm looking at these, they look a bit gross. This is just milk, I can tell. Well, I can tell, surprise you can see it through the freaking bag, Madeline. Capsicums and blueberries. I have a fuck ton of cucumbers. Yeah, because cucumbers go in all different kinds of juice. Carrots, I've already got two packs of carrots in the fridge, but you can never have too many carrots. Got a nice bouquet of kale here to go with my mint and my Parsley. Oh, thank you so much. Did I not get celery? Madeline. Mini garlic bread. Some Granny Smith apples. An iceberg lettuce. Some toasty cheese. This has been my shopping haul. Hello, it's Wednesday night. I haven't been a very good weekly vlogger this week, but I do have reasons for that. Um, on Monday, I went and had coffee with one of my friends from school and I did film a little bit, so I'll put that in here. <laughs> Yesterday, which was Tuesday, I just didn't really do much. I just slept and, oh, I need to paint my nails. Um, <laughs> and today, let me tell you about today, right? There's a reason I'm not filming this on my phone and that's because my phone is freaking broken. I didn't break it, like it's not smashed. It's died of old age. So I'm actually being punished for being responsible and not breaking my phone. That's what I'm sticking with anyway. So I'm really into like roll neck jumpers at the moment like hella into them I stalked them all online and I saw this one and I was like oh I really want that but then I was like oh it's 50 pounds but then like something happened that made me pissed off and I was like fuck that I'm gonna buy the jumper to reward myself for like dealing with this news anyway <laughs> so um this arrived today and I'm really happy regardless my phone's broken and it's pissing me off because I need to get a new phone now. But that's annoying because I've been saving for England and now it's like I have to go into my savings to buy a new phone and it's just annoying. It's just, it's just, it's annoying. It's very annoying. Have I said it's annoying? Because it's annoying. So that's what's been going on today. I was meant to go out tonight because this girl that I went to uni with was having going away drinks. I didn't do that because I was like freaking out because I was like, why is my phone broken? And you know when something goes wrong, you're just like, F this, like, I'm done with today. Long story long, my mom came over with the vacuum cleaner. I vacuumed the entire apartment. 
So now I'm in a fantastic mood because I fucking love vacuuming. It's like genuinely one of my favorite things. So now my room is really clean. And so I'm very happy with that. I'm very content with that. And I'm really happy about this jumper. This jumper is like, I love it so much. Um, so it's not a bad day. I just didn't do the things that I was meant to do. And I'm annoyed about my freaking phone. Excuse me, no, I'm not gonna not be able to film at 1D. You know what I mean? Like that's gonna ruin my entire life if that happens. So, it's a hard knock life, you guys. It certainly is. So there may be like very limited weekly vlog footage for the rest of this week. Cause I can film stuff if I'm at home cause I can just film it on my laptop. But if I'm out, like I'm not gonna carry my laptop or like my iPad around with me. Les is coming over tomorrow for dinner. She was meant to come over yesterday, but then like a couple things unfolded. So we rescheduled to Thursday. It's the last day of Mercury being in retrograde today. So like maybe that's what's going on. I don't know, but I, I know is I'm happy about this jumper. So. Ups and downs, swings and roundabouts, snakes and ladders, that's all for now. <laughs> this is what I've got going on today because I went to sleep with like semi-wet hair. That's an interesting tuft. Oh, oh. Cool. Fun fact, I thought George Michael, when he was in Wham, had hair like a fro flipped over to the side with an earring, but he didn't. I googled it. So who is that? Who am I thinking of that has, it is not, it's not Ross and Chandler when they do the flashback. I watched a documentary yesterday about how the Nazis were genetically engineering like extinct animals to come back so they could hunt them in this forest. Um, it was interesting. I also watched one about this Egyptian city, like ancient Egyptian city called Hercul Herculean, maybe? That is now under the ocean. So, um, I've been having a whale of a time. This has been my Friday check-in. I might check in again with you later. Um, hopefully, either my phone stops being broken, or I get a new one, so we can have a proper vlog next week. Yeah. Yeah, that would be nice, wouldn't it? Let's not get our hopes up, though, because it is still me, regardless of phone. I'm gonna go enjoy the fact that it's raining and maybe make some mac and cheese and charge my computer, because it's on 1%. Hey, hey, hey,
to get your phones out, just stick them in the air. And midnight on Saturday which means that the week is almost over and so is this vlog. Today was a fabulous day because first of all I got my phone working so I don't have to spend a billion dollars on a new one. Second I got to see McBusted. Third I got to see 1D. I forgot who they were because I got so excited about McBusted just then for a second. And now I've got HJs. I'm very behind on blog posts at the moment. That is one negatron of the past few days because I feel like since Mercury got out of retrograde, it's been fucking with me. Once Mercury went into retrograde, I got really productive. And now that it's gone out, I'm just like, can't be bothered to do anything. However, this morning I wrote um, an outline, like a character outline of um, a series of novels that I want to write. Um, so I did something productive. I just need to do a bunch of blog posts. But that's it. That's it for this week. This week went slightly better than last week, despite the fact that I couldn't film anything I actually did because I didn't have a phone for half the week. Goodbye. I'll see you in my next weekly vlog. Had a fabulous day. I hope you've had a fabulous Valentine's Day. Um, this time last year I'd just been broken up with and I was at a water polo tournament drinking wine with Sussy and that was also pretty great. But I think that McBusted 1D getting my phone working and a burger, um, wins so i hope you guys had great valentine's days if you didn't have a valentine who gives a fuck it's a fake holiday anyway other people love you you don't need one designated person that got very deep very quickly okay i'm gonna go now bye <laughs>